Hello, we have a commentary ten ball video. I like to play the ten ball near the magic rack there because it it will feel like uh, you are playing a match and you get used to having it there. So now we have a problem here, three seven. Two ball is in a tough place, but we can just uh, make it in a side. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Now we have the we have too much angle on the two ball. So the cue ball will go too, too far down, so that is why I will draw it back here to this rail, come out again. Whoops! I wanted to make the combination, but <laughs> this one is even, even better. A bunch shot in the side, soft. Man, I was lucky there, I was lucky there, I got good position on the three ball when I messed up that badly. Here I want to stop, I want to stop here. Top spin and right spin. Too far, oof, I hit that too thin also, so cue ball went too far up here. Here I can choose to go uh, this path, but then I will have an angle on this sixth ball, so I need to go back and forth for the seven. I will just, I will just go one rail up for the sixth ball. I hit that too thin, it rattles in the pocket there. But I I used the I used the correct speed so the cue ball did not go too far down. I wanted I wanted the cue ball to stop somewhere here. I failed, I hit that too thin, cue ball went too far up, it stopped there instead. That is the benefit of, of playing uh, position further away from the ball into a larger, larger area. In, in case you don't hit it straight in, okay? Now I will go back and forth, one rail, no, two rails. Two rails back and forth for the stem. Now I can just draw it back a little, and I have angle on the eight. No, I have too much angle on the seven, so the cue ball will stop there, and I think the shot is difficult. Shot is, shot is difficult there. I don't have a choice, I need to do it. I don't want to risk anything else. And I hit that too thin, so the cue ball went even further away. So this is a tough shot. Many players here use, uh, use a soft roll and miss the 8 because the table isn't level. So I rather go around the table. One, two, three, four rails around the entire table for position on the 9 ball. This way making the 8 ball is easier. Making the 8 ball is easier that way because you don't need to rely on the table being level. You can just shoot, you can just make the ball. Position is not that good. Here you can use a soft uh, left spin shot, left spin, but um, it is risky also. Difficult. You, if you shoot this shot harder, it becomes much easier. Because if you shoot softer, you get uh, a bigger throw effect. So this way uh, you can use, here you can use outside spin and shoot hard. One, two, three rails. Maybe here, outside spin. Outside spin is much easier than inside spin. So I will pick that. I will go to four rails position for the ten ball. With outside spin, little top spin. Yeah, that, that, what, what, oh, no, no. oh, ho, ho, ho. I was lucky there, you see that? Uh, I wanted to get here with the cue ball, I hit the points there. I could have scratched and, and lost the game there. But I, I, I still made the shot. If I had used inside spin on that shot, I would have missed it, guaranteed. Inside spin is something you want to avoid. I have, I have said that in uh, another video there. Uh, secret how you become pro. Uh, never use center ball. Watch that video. If you have not watched that, you need to do it. This is a missable shot. You can scratch in the side, in the corner. So you need to use outside spin. And this makes it, uh, using side spin makes it difficult. So uh, 
the, this shot would be easiest with the with the top spin, little less spin. But uh, the scratch is dangerous here. Very difficult now. Yeah, I will just shoot it, shoot it soft. Cue ball will stop before the corners here. I want to make sure to make the ten ball uh, more important uh, than risking a scratch here. You can easily avoid the scratch in the side by using a lot of left spin, but then you might miss the turn, so I don't want that. I will just focus on making it as you soft. If I miss the ten ball, the ten ball might stop there and the cue ball will be here and it, it will be difficult for the opponent, so that is the reason I, I choose to shoot it this way. Top spin, little left spin, the easiest way to make this shot. And I missed it. Ah, I should have hit that too thin. Let me make it again. Let me make it again. This time I will hit it too thin and you, you will see what I mean. Too thin here. And I, ma I, and I made it. I, I made it. I wanted to miss that shot. Okay, so the cue ball stopped here like a plan. Yes, okay, so I will show you what would, what would happen if if I had hit that uh, too thin. I want to show you. If I hit that too thin, I will, I will still get away with it. If I hit it too thin. No, what, what is happening? I wanted to miss that shot. I wanted to miss that shot. And the cue ball stopped in the almost same place. Okay, one last time, hit it too thin. Yeah, like that, okay? You missed it. Cue ball comes to the other side. You see, that is the way you need to play that shot. If you miss, if you miss the shot. It is like a safety shot if you miss the shot too thin. So I recommend you, you choose uh, the shot uh, that way, that if you miss, you will get... Uh, it, it will be a safety, okay? So. That is the end of this video. Subscribe. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.